Hello friends, this video on playing with numbers part 21 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Let us now move on to the divisibility by 10. A number is divisible by 10 if the number has 0 in its 1's place. Now this is very very simple. Now whenever you have to find whether a number is divisible by 10 or not, the only thing that you need to bother about is the digit at its unit's place or 1's place. Now if there is a 0, that is if the last digit is 0, then it is divisible by 10, otherwise it is not. So let us look at some examples, 15900. Zero, zero. Do you think this is divisible by 10? Of course, because there is a a zero at its units place so this is divisible by 10 let's take other example like 9601 now at the units place we have 1 so this is not divisible by 10 so it there has to be a zero at the last place you talk about an example like this 1980000 zero, 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 zero. again there is a zero at the units place so this is also divisible by 10 now, if you want by actual division, you can see that, I mean, whatever I have told, they hold true. Now, uh, again, the same question, how does it work? Why is it that if there is a zero at the unit space, that number will be divisible by 10? Now, in order to understand this, let us quickly look at the multiples of 10. Now, if you start writing the multiples of 10, it would be something like this. 10 1s are 10, 10 2s are 20, 10 3s are 30, 10 4s are 40 and so on. Now, as you keep writing the multiples, everywhere you would see that is a, there is a zero at its units place. Doesn't matter how big the number is. It might be a 10 digit number, but at the last place, there, was, there will always be a zero. So basically, when we look at this divisibility rule, when we say that there is a zero at the units place, that means there is a zero at the last place that means that that number is going to be a multiple of 10 which simply means that the number is divisible by 10. Thank you. Please visit examfear.com for free quality education. You can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons, you can ask your questions, you can refer notes and you can take a free online test. We have content for class 6 to 12 on physics, chemistry, mathematics and biology along with practical videos. So please subscribe to our channel for daily updates. Thank you.